Hi, uh, this tutorial shows you a couple of new features in uh, custom properties allowed. So, first thing uh, I want to mention uh, that it's possible to assign a Wi-Fi fragment modifier using this custom properties allowed. All you need to do is just select this object. As you can see, it updates automatically. And uh, picking pick different uh, Voronoi fragmentation types. As you can see, wood splinters and bricks doesn't support this. Only this six fragmentation types. So all you need to do is just select this object, or maybe more. You can select several objects. Uh, assign uh, custom properties. Actually, you don't need to do this. You just need to turn this on just to assign this values to this uh, properties. Pick a fragmentation type you need. Uh, set properties like uh, four iterations and uh, 34 sprint points and uh, click add so as you can see now this object has a refire fragmenter with custom point cloud and uh, you can move this point cloud if you want to adjust position of point cloud and fragment as you can see it uh, refragments it instantly so if you need more fragments here you can add them here or move it here here scale whatever if you don't like uh, you can keep remove and change some properties and add again if you like this one you can keep it if you don't like click on remove change properties Add more, okay. So, uh, if you like, you can keep it and use it with uh, this detachable elements fragmentation type in your simulation. If you don't like, you can try any other, like radio. And of course, if you want to add more fragmenters, you can change it to a different one, like uniform, variations to 30, add one more. So we have these two fragmenters on top of each other.